Programming the Timer Core Module Now for Continuous Cleaning. Continuous Clean will allow you to set a specific time to pulse clean your filters. For example, if you select 20 seconds, the pulse cleaning system will activate every 20 seconds, cleaning the filters. Our GSX controller factory setting for continuous cleaning is 15 seconds. To set a different time, we will have to move to the inside of the GSX controller. Inside, we have a core timer module which has several different features that we're going to look at. In the middle of the module, you have a program selector switch and the module is currently in run mode. To adjust the settings, we must be in program mode. Press and hold the selector switch for two seconds. PR9 will display, which stands for program. Then, use the selector switch to move back and forth to select a feature that you want to adjust. Once your LED is on a setting you want to adjust, press the selector switch again to adjust that setting. Solenoid output. This value sets how many solenoids will be pulsed and is adjustable from one up to the maximum number of solenoids available. The number of expansion boards connected to the system on power up determines the maximum number of solenoids available. On power up, the controller pulls the CAN bus to determine the number of outputs available. This number can be viewed by selecting the output program item. Note that when manually selecting the last output in this manner, the current sense feature of the controller is not enabled and that all solenoids from one through the last will be operated. To enable the current sense feature, set the solenoid output program item to A or auto and press and release the program select knob. The controller will briefly operate each output and record its corresponding current consumption value to determine if there is a solenoid present at that output. During this time, the solenoid output LED will flash. When the test is complete, the LED will again light solid and the display will show the last output. This is also a good tool to determine if the solenoids have been wired properly and functioning correctly. Solenoid on time sets the on duration of the pulse. It is adjustable from 0.10 seconds to 0.50 seconds, but we recommend you keep it at the factory setting of 0.15 seconds. Solenoid off time sets how many seconds between each pulse and is adjustable from 1 to 999 seconds. When using continuous cleaning, this setting tells the pulse system how long to wait between pulse cycles. Factory setting is 15 seconds. On the right side of the board is our offline cleaning section. These settings are for manual cleaning or cleaning offline. This is for cleaning at the end of a workday when the collector and fan are turned off. The offline setting activates a round of pulsing to help knock all that dust down. With the fan off and no dust being pulled in through the collector, it allows the pulsing to better clean the filters. Offline cleaning can be set up to automatically clean the filters when we turn our motor starter off for the blower. To have access to this feature, you will have additional wiring during installation. Offline cleaning cycle sets the number of cleaning cycles the unit will attempt after the offline clean switch is opened. The number of cycles is adjustable from 1 to 20, and three dash marks indicates disabled. Offline cleaning time delay sets the delay from the time the offline clean switch is opened until the offline cleaning sequence begins. This time is adjustable from 60 to 600 seconds. Standby mode allows the outputs to be disabled, while the monitoring functions of the controller continue to operate. For any questions about the GSX controller, give us a call at 870-933-7643 or visit us at camphillapc.com.